My brother uh, George was involved in sports. He played the Class B football in high school, and Calvin played uh, uh, Class C football uh, in Poly. And they both, and Shozo also played football, and they all lettered in, in the sport, you know. I like remember Mer December 7th, it was a Sunday morning, and we had gone to church, and uh, coming home, we passed by the grocery store, you know, Takaki, and they said, you know, Japan was bombed, we couldn't believe it. So we all ran home, turned the radio on. You know, and there's broadcasting all over, and everybody was listening to him. And they called the FBI, and they came and took, came in and searched our house, uh, our apartment, you know, and they took our radio. And uh, they thought we were spies or something <laughs> like that, that we had to evacuate, you know. So we had to s get rid of everything in short notice, you know, without the, well, uh, December 7th. And by uh, March and April, we were in, going into camps. George was a real American. You know, he, he re really believed in America. and He thought that the right thing to do was to volunteer. They volunteered f from camp. So I was in camp in Amachi, Colorado when they, when they left. Yeah. They just went on the army truck and left, said mm -hmm. goodbye. <laughs> um. Late in the war, when the European theater was going on, uh, Calvin and George were over there you know, in the fighting in the European theater by volunteering and going and fighting yeah, they the felt was that the they right believed thing. in. Mm -hmm. uh, I think that was sufficient uh, evidence as to, without talking about it, you know. His actions speak louder than words, I think. But when George passed away, you know, that, that was just a, yeah. a real shocker. Age, I was in my 20s, uh, 20, 21, 22. Mm -hmm. Just like felt like the bottom fell. <laughs> I, you know, George was uh, the family favorite. He just he he um, I'm sorry. <laughs> in spite of all the hardships that uh, we've gone through. I think it was a learning uh, for all generations to come, I think, of, of, of the, uh, the, the so-called injustices that were uh, upon the, uh, the Japanese Americans here in the United States, and uh, a kind of a uh, precursor of anything else that may have happened to other, might happen to other races, you know.